Another day, another gameplay. What's going on, guys? Breezy coming in with my review of the Combat Rig Warfighter. Now, let's take a look at the trailer and then we'll get into the payload and the traits. Now, as you can see there, not too much shown off in the trailer apart from the claw, which is the rapid fire spread shot firearm. Um, it's the first payload you'll actually get. It has ballistic rounds, which uh, ricochets off the walls, off other people, and just absolutely decimates the enemy. Um, it's really good up close and personal, but from range it kind of dies. As it says there, it's a spread shot. You can aim down sight for focus damage, but even then, you're not getting super long range out of it. There's other specialists that give you quite a bit more range, but you know, this is a strong weapon in those close range maps, and you're going to go absolutely ham uh, using it. Now, the second payload you're going to unlock for the Warfighter is Combat Focus, and this is going to give you double points for your streak for a limited time. I think it's about 15 seconds. Um, as you get a kill, it's the same as Black Ops 3. It's going to speed up a little bit, and uh, it's going to really help you out getting those big kill streaks. It is part of the assault. Uh, rig on the game so it's going to absolutely help you to just decimate the enemies and get those big shrieks. Now the third payload you're going to unlock is Overdrive and it's going to be the exact same as Black Ops 3, give you that little speed boost, give you that competitive edge, get into the objective nice and quick, um, so not too much to say on that one. Now the first trait we're going to look at is Ping, now this should be familiar to a Call of Duty player, it was in COD Ghost, it was in Modern Warfare 3, now it's going to drop a little ping off every time you get a kill and just tell you where the nearby enemies are, it really helps you with those big streaks and staying alive and I like highly recommend it as the trait to be used on the Warfighter. Now the second trait for the Warfighter is Persistence, now this disables the reset of score streaks so you can't overlap your score streaks over and over again, um, but it also increases the points on which it takes to earn these score streaks. Now I don't recommend this one because I put it on and I put the highest kill streaks in the game on. I scored 6,300 points for the game and was unable to earn the highest streak. So this one, you know, could be good if you just want to earn one UAV a game, but it's going to increase the points and at the meantime, during the beta, it's just going to be too out of reach for you guys to get those streaks that you want to use. Now the third and final trait for the Warfighter is going to be resupply and this is going to give you extra lethal and your tacticals by picking up ammo boxes on kills that you haven't got with a grenade. It's only going to give it for non-explosive ballistics and uh, energy weapons. So I don't actually recommend this one because it doesn't actually refill your ammo in your gun. It only refills your lethal grenades and your tactical grenades. There is actually a perk scavenger um, which I recommend using instead. But you know, if you guys want to throw more nades or you know protect the objective by doing that, by all means, go and use resupply. But uh, primarily, I'd use ping as the trader choice on the Warfighter. So, hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, remember to rate, subscribe, comment, favorite, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. They'll all be in the description below. And I'll see you guys on my next one. Peace.